Someone asked me to make a video showing how to install and set up Luna if it's your first time. So that's what I'm gonna do today. And I'm gonna try to make it as short and as simple as possible. But first I wanna let you guys know that the Home Recording Network doesn't only make YouTube videos on Logic and Luna and things like that. I also help home studio engineers like yourself improve your skills. So if you're interested in anything like that, go and sign up for my free online mix training that I hold a couple times a week that's gonna help you improve your skills instantly. And you'll also get a copy of my home studio mix guide just for registering for the training. And that's all in the description. All right, so if you're just getting started with Luna and you need to install and basically start from scratch, I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. And this will also work if Luna isn't automatically checking for updates or you're not able to update from inside Luna. So this is another way to do that. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is head over to you audio.com that's universal audio's website and you are going to go right up here to downloads now after you get here you can just click on luna right here and you can hit download for mac os and obviously this doesn't work on windows so if you if you have a windows system you can't use luna uh, so if you click here you can just download luna but what you're going to want to do is Get Luna plus UAD for Mac OS. So after you've downloaded all the software, you should have this Luna folder in your downloads folder, and you're gonna have three items in there. One is Luna itself, two is UA Connect, and three is your actual firmware for your Apollo interface. Now you're gonna wanna make sure that you have the latest version for your Apollo interface, the latest version of UA Connect, and then also the latest version of Luna. That's why I recommend downloading all of this and installing all of this before just downloading the Luna software and installing that. So the first piece of software you're gonna wanna install is the firmware for your UAD interface down here. So install that. It might take some time, your computer's gonna reboot, but once you have that installed, you're ready for the next step. Next, you're gonna to wanna to install UA Connect because I believe this is now actually needed to run Luna. Uh, but this is also where any of your native plugins will be held. So if you have a UAD Spark subscription, you're gonna need this. And if you have any UAD plugins that are now offered in Spark, you'll get those native plugins for free. So. Next, you're gonna to wanna to click on UA Connect and install that. Now, for both Luna and UA Connect, you do need an iLock account. So when you install UA Connect, it will automatically install the iLock License Manager. Now, once UA Connect and the iLock License Manager are installed, you can go ahead and open UA Connect and log in with your UAD credentials. Once you're all logged in on UA Connect, you can then click get started and it will prompt you to either create an iLock account if you don't have one or log in with your current iLock account. Now, this account will be created with your UAD email address, whatever you use to log in to Universal Audio and it will be created without a password. So in that case, you'll have to go to iLock.com, click forgot password and set up your password for the first time. Now, when you're finished setting UA Connect up, you are finally ready to install Luna. So you can click on the Luna installation DMG and get that started. Once you've installed Luna, you can log in with your UA credentials. And then again, it's gonna ask you for your iLock account in which you can use your email address and the password that you've just set up with UA Connect. Once you're all logged in, you should be at this page right here in which you could go to manage to actually download and install any of the free instruments or extensions and even start demos for any of the paid ones. Once that's all done, you are ready to hop into Luna and start recording and mixing. So you can name your first session right here, hit create and hop into your first ever Luna session. Guys, if you want any more help with Luna, feel free to check out some of my other videos that I've made 
on this DAW and feel free to reach out with any questions. Happy mixing. Hey guys, if you like this video, make sure and go grab a copy of my home studio mix guide with your go-to EQ and compression settings for all your tracks. And also go ahead and register for my online mix training that I hold a couple times a week so that you can learn how to turn your home recorded tracks into a professional product.